Pope Francis has blessed and approved same-sex marriage. For those of you who do not understand, let me just uh, break it down for you. Pope Francis does approve, say, all Catholic Church, the priest, fit wed, same-sex marriage. That is, if a man and a man come to a Catholic Church to wed, Pope Francis, as I told us, approved, as directed the priest to go ahead and wed them. If woman and woman come to church, Catholic church say they want wed, the priest already has the approval, the professor approval to wed them. That is what it means. You know, and again, I want to make this clear. This is a very delicate issue. Hmm? And whoever is speaking on this matter should always remember <laughs> You cannot speak on it anyhow you like. You need to be extremely careful with your words, extremely careful with the way you narrate it. If not, you will be cancelled. That is what the world is going to. They say there's freedom of speech, but there is no freedom of speech. You cannot wholeheartedly speak your mind. Everybody say face your front, face your front. They are automatically telling you to forget, to forget your root, to forget what your great grandfather taught you, to forget anything that has to do with that. Forget it, and this is the new rule. That is what they're telling us. And you cannot speak on it. You can't. You can't. Talk. So you have to be extremely careful with the way you speak. Me say, I'm extra careful with my words, with what I say about this particular news. So Pope Francis has approved it. I'm good and fine. But I don't know how in Africa countries or some countries that have wholeheartedly uh, banned same-sex marriage. I don't know how they are going to go about it because there are still Catholic churches there. So I don't know if their priests have the ultimate jurisdiction uh, to, to supersede the constitution of that country going ahead to wed same-sex marriage. I don't know if it's going to apply. Like now in Nigeria, you know, even if we do not care about, we do not pay attention to uh, the LGBTQ community, even though the federal government do not pay attention to the LGBTQ community, and we have constitution in place to punish uh, LGBTQ, that doesn't mean we do not allow it. We allow it in our country. It's flourishing really, really well. So sometimes you might see some few arrests. They arrest also some persons for partying, they arrest. But there has, I don't think there has been any one person that has been charged here to court. I don't think so. They have been uh, jailed. I don't think so. So we allowed it in this country. So if a priest in Catholic Church in Nigeria, somewhere in my own uh, uh, village, there's, there's this big Catholic Church there. So if that priest now, if, if that priest decided to wait, wait say, sex marriage, based on the fact that their overall has approved it. Will that priest be liable to face the full wrath of the law? You know, Pope, Pope the Pope is the head of our room, the head of Rome. So we do not know how they are going to move from here. We're still going to be watching. And they're understanding the progress. Well, like I've said before, you need to be extremely careful. You have to be careful with your words. That is, if you know you are eating from uh, the media. If you are eating from the media, you have a YouTube channel, Instagram, Twitter, and you have a business online, and this and that, you need to be extremely careful. Because they're going to remove bread from your mouth. They're going to flag you. You know? 
So, <laughs> Wala, deal. But well, no Wala, Sha. No Wala. That was the latest yesterday from Pope. Uh, Pope. Uh, is it Pope Francis? Yeah, I think so. Sorry, I don't really follow up though. Then let's talk about an incident that happened in Nigeria. Spiral. You're the only fine girl, only fine girl in the room. I think nicest thing. Who is your friend? So Spyro and uh, Pastor Bola J uh, Adowa Ido of uh, Avesta Church have been uh, dragged by Nigeria after he invited Spyro to perform at the church Christmas carol. And of course, we saw Spyro singing and, uh, and uh, doing his thing uh, well, but majority of Nigeria were pleased with that. Very pleased with that because they still believe that ah, this is the house of God, and the house of God do not, do not celebrate, do not like uh, cellular uh, songs. <laughs> if the house of God can wed same sex marriage, then why are you saying that the house of God do not like cellular songs? The other day, portable group perform for a uh, select church, and boom, they start blasting portable. <laughs> so I don't. I think everything applies now. I don't think there is one rule that 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 cannot be broken. I don't think there is one rule, one immoral immorality that cannot be broken. So you guys should allow Spyro to perform. And leave uh, Pastor Idu alone. People were dragging him, calling him all sorts of names, blasting him, and things like that. What he did was it good for allowing Aspiro to come perform in the church? <laughs> haven't you heard? Haven't you heard about the about the same sex? Haven't you heard? So. It applies to everything. You guys should leave the uh, spiral. But however, though, it was uh, they were trying to act a play. You know, usually they act play to show people to kind of like describe some issues to the to describe a script for for the viewers and everything. That was what they were doing. Spiral performed. Well, let's listen to Spiral to check his now a conversation on twitter it's a conversation on um instagram <sighs> so first off avestas is my church like i'm a choir member in avestas and you could go check that out that's on facts i attend avestas that's my church once again and i'm a choir member in the church I'm not just a choir member in Avestas. I also serve at, um, I serve um, in another unit, which is the venue management. Venue management, we are the people that clean the church. Um, you know, we go to church and clean the church for, you know, service use. So, I don't understand. Um, I wasn't paid. You know, ain't nothing wrong in me serving my God because I'm a celebrity that should not restrict me from service, you know. So that was a drama in church. Fantasia, Fantasia is the carol service that held yesterday. And um, the clip of, the clip that was posted on Insta blog or that was posted on Twitter is a clip of the drama that we did yesterday and i was supposed to seduce the king's wife you know i was supposed to seduce the king's wife in the drama which was why i was um singing only fine girl to her you know so i did that and the king got pissed and was asked and asked his guards to cut my head off you know which is a typical story of Herod in the Bible. Um, 
will is is a selfish man and always want the spotlight on him i mean he doesn't want nobody to take the spotlight you know that was what we were trying to do indeed it was a drama though i can testify to that because i saw the full uh like some of the clips so it wasn't like a straight performance him coming to perform this normal performance now an artist performs so it wasn't that it was a drama so please uh, you guys should stop spreading fake news so let's move past that i want to make this clear please you guys should leave dj copy alone please that guy is going through a lot already how can someone make this kind of remark on this is copy's photo after she posted these photos this guy said make person marry this woman now he's really aging May person marry this woman now. Uh, she is really aging. Apa, is that not too harsh? Why don't you want to mind your own goddamn business? That was too harsh. Let the woman breathe. She tell you say she did look for person may want marry her. That was too goddamn harsh. Let her breathe. 